I'm Skylar Tibbetts. I'm the director of the Self-Assembly Lab at MIT's Architecture Department. Forty printing started as a collaboration with Stratasys, and what we were trying to do was basically take smart materials and combine that with 3D printing. So printing uh, materials that change shape, change property, or change appearance. So it's sort of like robotics, um, but without the wires and motors. We said four because we wanted to add time. So printing objects that transform over time. What's most exciting about this for you? Is it coming up with the end product or figuring out how to get there? I like to be able to invent and, and have the abstract and knowledge discovery and, and wild ideas and, and create the future. But I also like to be able to find ways that those technologies can be implemented to have real world application. We have a different pair of shoes for everything we do. And so therefore, can you have walking shoes that turn into running shoes? that then creates support when you're playing sports or grow cleats when you're on grass or waterproof when it starts raining or breathable when it's hot. You know, Adaptable shoes or garments or equipment that help us perform better, but also respond and adapt to the fluctuating environment. about tires in the automotive space that we have a different set of tires for everything we do like off-road tires, winter tires, racing tires, etc. Um, and if you change the either property or shape of the tire you get more or less grip. Do you have a goal set in mind for this lab at this point <laughs> or is it just let's go out and discover? I try to look at it as half serendipity and half by design. You know, a lot of times we get lucky, a lot of times we get surprised, and you want to foster that coincidence, the chance, the excitement. Um, and then the other part is that we want to design it, and we want to design and invent the future. And so part of ours is just, if it seems impossible, let's do it. Let's try to invent the future. If we have no idea how to make a material change shape, or if we have no idea how things could assemble themselves, let's go for it. 